Question number 19 is a grammar question on sentence structure and conjunctions. So the room is simple but spacious, and then you come across this really long sentence talking about all three walls. If you simplify it down just a little bit, what you realize is that it introduces the room, so the room is simple with, and then you talk about three walls. A sink along, one wall. A stove against, another wall. And a table under the third wall. So you can see what's there, is, I've highlighted in green, and then one wall, another wall, the third wall in blue. And so which choice most closely matches the stylistic pattern established earlier in the sentence? Um, it, it's actually great the way it is. There's no change necessary. B, a small table, is under the third wall's window. That turns this into an independent clause, and you, you can't have that. Um, and there's no verb here. It doesn't say the word is in the in the others, so we shouldn't introduce the word is here. And then C and D are uh, just constructed in the opposite order. So you, I mean, just I've color coded it. It goes green, blue, green, blue, green, blue. But then, and the green comes first. But then here, the blues come first. We don't want to talk about the third wall first. We talk about a window, the the wall. So it has to go green first and then blue. And these C and D are in the wrong order. That's why A is the correct.